Our story continues with Hoje dreaming about Chao Kei and monstrous creatures before waking up. He finds himself is handcuffed. Detective Ji Su shows up, shocking him that the bat has only his fingerprints, and Yang Gil is critically injured. She asks him about Chao Kei, but he acts ignorance. His last memory is of Yang Gil knocking him out while he hugs Chao Kei. The cops arrive at the abandoned factory and are confused by the destruction and lack of dead bodies. They find a canister of nitrogen belonging to Ji and Siung Biotechnology. Center. Meanwhile, Song Jo visit Hoje at the hospital. He asks him if he wants to find Chao Kei who is imprisoned in Jian Siung Hospital's underground cells. Hoje visits Yang Gil before he sneaks out with Siung Jo. He asks him why he hit him. Yang Gil begs him not to go back. The cops arrive at the hospital, but Hoje is long gone. At Jian Siung Center, the doctors scan Chao Kei and discover that her Najin latched to the back of her brain. Like Siung Jo's case, contrary to the usual, Najin embeds itself on top of the brain. That is because Yung Zhou, Chao Kei must have gotten a mature Najin from their mothers. Meanwhile, Chao Kei is trying to break out when Zhang Haiyok from the next cell reveals that it is useless. He reveals how Jiansian Center approached him for a trial to cure his polio. He narrates they bring him and other people, being given water contains Najin. If they drink it, 10 million one will be given to their parents. If the trial is a success, they will be healed from their different diseases. Most subjects are dying, while he is scared. Najin lurks inside his neck and Chao Kei is shocked. Meanwhile, Ho Jae rushes home and tries to find answers from Yang Gil's desk. He spots different photos of him with Yang Gil's grandpa Jun Taik. He suddenly relives the memory when Mrs. Nawol fusses over his tie. Jun Taik is shy but Taesang pulls him into the photo. Ho Jae recalls Chao Kei staring at a wall in his company. He realizes that it is wooden and breaks it. It leads to Taesang's treasury, seeing many fake IDs with his face. He also finds the wanted poster of Chao Kei. After she killed Professor Ichiro, suddenly Siung Jo arrives and takes Hoje to Jiansian Center, where a water tank that contains Najin and asks Hoje to go back to the way he was before. Captain Kuriko visits Chao Kei, who has many questions. He tells her that Anzong Hospital has turned into Jiansiung Biotechnology Center. It was founded by Kato and Meida and is currently run by Kato's son, Professor Jio. He drags her to meet Ms. Meida. Chao Kei gets shocked, seeing Ms. Meida at the same form she was before the explosion. 